Well, a change in the Milwaukee Police Department's procedure when it comes to immigration status, and that has some immigrant rights groups upset. Yeah, they say the mayor is going back on his comments that he supports immigrants. Tom Durian was at that news conference today, and he's now live in the studio tonight with what both sides have to say, huh, Tom? Well, George, the changes to the Standard Operating Procedure, or SOP, were made in the process of a grant application to the federal government. The language in the past that officers shall not inform the feds of immigration status. Now it says they shall following federal guidelines for certain crimes. We are not a sanctuary city. We had good policy. It made sense. And it was driven not by politics, but by wanting to keep everyone in our community safe and secure. Compliance with the federal government required the changes in the language and the Milwaukee City Attorney made them. Voces de la Frontera and the League of United Latin American Citizens are calling on Mayor Tom Barrett and the Police and Fire Commission to abandon the changes. So why, why when we see other municipalities, other counties, other states suing the federal government over this requirement, are we not only trying to comply but exceed the requirement of Donald Trump's enforcement of the statute. In a statement today, the mayor's office said, quote, there are technical changes being made to police rules that will meet the requirements the federal government imposed on the city in past years, end quote. In fact, the mayor's office tells me the requirements go back to the Obama administration. But VOSA's executive director, Christine Newman-Ortiz, sees it as a betrayal. And he said, I will stand with you. Yeah. So we're asking him to stand up to Trump. The mayor's office says he has consistently expressed his view of the importance and value of our immigrant community. His view has not changed in the slightest. Well, the city made a point today in saying that they will not use officers to enforce immigration laws. That is the job of the feds. If you'd like to read the changes to the SOP and see the proposed language from today's groups, we've posted them online at TMJ4.com. The changes by the way, go into effect tomorrow. All right, thank you, Tom.